What up? My name is Lickyman and welcome back to Would You Rather. Um, you guys remember this? When I played it, like, oh gosh, in December? What is it now? July? Seven months, nearly, kind of, yeah, seven months, sorry. But I want to play this game again because, I don't know, I just want to play it. Um, anyway, but this time there's a twist, not like Jelly Belly Star, but every time I get a question right, I'm going to have a, like, tell the road. By getting a question right, I mean, whoever, if I chose, like, something that the majority of the people chose then that's the mark for me anyway let's get straight in so as a gentleman would you rather paint your nails or wear high heels now me i would paint my nails because like high heels i can't not i don't know how to walk in high heels and i'll probably keep on falling over and like they're really narrow at the thing at like the end and that must hurt your pinky toes and all of that so i'd rather paint your nails because then at least you can hide it with gloves like look i have this glove for my thingy for my like digital tablet see you can hide them it's so much better kind of i i don't know would you rather be barefooted for the rest of your life or wear crocs for the rest of your life Crocs. What? Why would you be barefooted? You could get so many like infections and stuff like that. Crocs aren't that bad. Okay, they are pretty bad, but they're not that bad. Would you rather be trapped in a sandstorm or be trapped in a snowstorm? Both are really bad because if you're trapped in a sandstorm, that stuff could get in your eyes and that would kill. But it also hurts because it's like basically pieces of glass flying at you at super high speeds and you get cuts and bruises. But if you're trapped to the snow, snowstorm, I guess that's even what you're basically suffocating. That's if you fall. And yeah, you can't see anything. It's the same with sandstorm, to be honest with you. You just can't see anything, but it's a lot softer. And even if you do get trapped, like if you have snow all over you, you just wee wee. And then it like melts the snow. And at least to show other people where you are because it leaves like a yellow mark. I know how to do things. So yeah, you have to read if you had if you had to read only one series for the rest of your life, would you rather read Harry Potter or Twilight? Uh Harry Potter. Not because I hate Twilight, I haven't I've never seen him. And it's more like a romantic comedy not comedy, but a romantic kind of thing. And I just rather Harry Potter because I actually love Harry Potter quite a lot. I grew up watching it like every single day of my life. Uh would you rather have a would you rather have a would you rather professional chauffeur, a pers a professional? Personal chauffeur, a personal chef. Chauffeur. Really? But I'm so young. Professional chef. I mean personal chef. But you could just like make it yourself. It's not that hard. What? Fine. No Toblerone for me then. <laughs> Would you rather be a character in Lord of the Rings or be a character in Harry Potter? Do you get to choose? Because I would be. Uh. I don't know. I would be Harry, but then like he's had some tragic things happen to him. And it's quite scary having Voldemort like being your arch nemesis because he looks really scary. Like especially when I was young. Where was it? I think it was the fifth one, Harry Potter. I don't know. It's the fifth one where he was at the train station, Voldemort just standing there, like he was so stood out. Oh gosh, that scared me so much. Oh gosh. But Harry Potter because I've never read Lord of the Rings or seen it. I know a lot of people are gonna say watch it, watch it, but no. Would you rather get chopped up by a wood chipper? Or get run over by a steamroller. Ooh, wood chipper? Because that's instant. It depends where the steamroller starts from. If it starts, I know this is getting really gruesome now. But if it starts from the head, you just that's it. It's instant, kind of. Or I, I don't know. Hopefully it is. I don't know. Um. But then if you get wood by a wood chipper, like uh, then. Your feet, ow, and then it depends where you start. Then it gets, uh, I don't know. Steamroller? Yay! Toblerone time! This is actually a lot of Toblerone, and now I'm getting really hyper. I've had a lot already. But yeah, continue. Would you be rather, would you rather be unable to shower for two weeks, but have clean clothes only, be able to shower daily for two weeks, but unable to change your clothes? Can you put on deodorant? Wait. Oh, this includes the ability or inability to brush your teeth, 
And or apply anything that makes your s- Aw, oh, no! Um, I don't know, it depends. It depends on the clothes. I don't know if they get dirty for two weeks. Well, it depends. Uh, then again, I would rather do it in the holidays if I wasn't gonna shower. I mean, if I was gonna wear like the same clothes. Because then at least no one would see me. I don't know. Uh, I think be unable to, yeah, be unable to shower for two weeks, but I have clean clothes. Because then at least it will mask your smell. Ki kind of. Would you rather teach history or math? I actually love both. I love maths. I know that sounds pretty weird. Not that many pe kids like maths. And I also love history. I love both of them. Um, and partly because, like, I just love history. I don't know why I've always loved history. And plus, it's kind of like a thing to be, like, a lawyer. And this is, like, one of the things to be a banker. Or kind of like a pilot. Because you need maths and bearings and all that. Um, oh, I don't know. History is kind of easy. Kind of. You just have to learn lots of information. And then just put it down on paper, just teach your students. Math, you have to learn like tons of equations and tons of thingies. Um, history, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I can't have anyone to have their own. Because I'm getting super hyper. Um, nom, nom, nom. Okay, what's next? Would you rather fly like Superman or travel like, Sp travel like Spider Man? What? What? You rather fly like Superman? Spider Man's so cool with his webs! You've just been zipping all over the place! Superman? What? Spider-Man's so much cooler, you could just go like this and that and pull and... It, oh, what? Wait, it depends if we have like the sticky finger hands. Just think you could do like cool moves. Like, like the gameplay demo of the new Spider-Man game. Fine! Would you rather save the Library of Alexandra from burning or know what happened to Atlantis? Like artsy kind of things. I know what happened to Atlantis. Because Atlantis is pretty cool. It's like a city. It's kind of like Venice. It's like a city which is at the bottom of the ocean somewhere. Do we even know where it is? I don't think we know where it is. Wait, let me check. Oh, I don't think we know exactly. But we will be told. No, you will not be civilly be told with Atlantis. I'd rather just know what happened about Atlantis because I'm more of a fan of like underwater stuff than like artsy kind of stuff. I don't know why. Um, oh no, why do you have to do this? Be, be deep sea diving and your oxygen tank runs out or be bungee jumping and have your cord snap? Um, 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 um. Okay, if you're deep sea diving, it depends how deep we are. Because if we're quite, like, high up-ish, like if we're 10 meters down, then you can kind of swim that. Like, you can just, like, find out your oxygen tank right now, you can, like, <coughs> swim. Oh, um, it depends if you, how far you are down. Does it even say? No. But be bungee jumping and have your cord snap. It depends. You don't have parachutes on when you're bungee jumping. No, you don't. Oh gosh, I don't know. Wait, it depends where we are bungee jumping from. And it depends when the cord snaps, because if we're bungee jumping above a bridge, which, are we, does it normally do that? I, I don't know. But if we are, then we can like bungee jump, and if we like stop, so if like the water's here, and we're here, and if it snaps here, then like, if no, let's say if we're going down, it's just about to bungee back up, and then it snaps. And like literally quite a lot of your momentum, momentum will be taken out because of that extension that pulling back on you and then like you'll just full stuff I don't know this one yeah I don't know just because of my like just because of what I said I don't know maybe oh no 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 go to a gunfight with a pellet pistol I mean that hurts I got shown in a butt once I don't like that person, it's my cousin who did that. I got shot in the butt once with a BB gun, pellet gun, whatever you want to call it, and that hurt a lot. Or go to a knife fight with a butter knife. Uh, gun fight. Because if I, let's say, if I do die, hopefully I won't, but let's say if I do die, then it'll be instant. It depends actually where they shoot me. Because if they shoot me here, then it's instant. If they shoot me lower down, then that would hurt. But with a butter knife, no matter where they hit you, it's gonna hurt a lot. It's like really slow and painful death. The pellet pistol is and the butter knife is standard. Yeah, I think I'll do this. Really? Mm, no! 
Oh, but that. Ow, that hurts. Oh, gosh. If you had a mutation of your choice, uh, have an extra. Uh, would you rather. Oh, would you rather have an extra limb or an extra eyeball? Um. Um. Well, it depends what limb. If I had an extra arm, then I could do a lot more. Oh, if I had an extra leg, I could probably, hopefully, run a lot faster. If I had an extra eyeball, could I see more? Could, like, I have one in the middle, and then... But then, like, what's the point of that? It depends if, like, one goes here, one goes here, then I could see, like, literally 360. I say limb, just for my arm thing, so I could do, like, more things at the same time. I don't know. It just... Would you rather be stalked by Slenderman or take part in one of Jigsaw's games? Okay, just by saying that, I'm gonna look back now, just to make sure. Send them on. Jigsaw. They're not here. It's cool. Um, Beast looks like Cinderman. That is pretty scary, because he's like, whoa, he's wearing a suit. And he's like looking like, hey, do I look good? Do you want to come on a date with me? That's why. That's why he stalks all of the young kids. He says, hey, my wife left me three and a half years ago. Do you want to come on a date with me now, please? That's why he's still wearing a suit. And the reason why he has eight million arms is because. I don't know, multitasker, man. Um, anyway, and then Jigsaw. Jigsaw's games are kind of crazy. Not kind of crazy, but very crazy. So, I'd rather be take part in Jigsaw because... No! You'd rather be stalked by Slenderman. Oh, it didn't say... Well, it didn't say what time of day. Because if it's during the day, then, like, you just look behind you and say, Hey, I see you! I see you following me! Fight a shark with bare arms. Fight a bear with shark arms. Bear arms. Have you seen the claws? Like open season. What's his name? Oh no, what's his name? The bear from open season. Oh, is it Boo? Oh no, I forgot. No, I gotta search this. Boog. Yeah, that's it. Boog. And Elliot, the uh, one thingy and the deer. Oh, I love that film so much. Especially the first one. And the second, oh, the second one's so good. Oh, I love both, all of, all three of them. Even though I haven't watched three that much, I kind of want to watch it, rewatch it. And there's a Halloween version, I think. There's so many versions. Would you rather burp extremely loud every 30 seconds or let out a smelly, long-lasting fart every five minutes? Um, burp. Because when I'm at home, I'll just do it in private. I can just quickly run. Like 30 seconds go like Bleh! and then I'll be like, I'll be right back guys, and they just go like this, like Bleh! and then you're like, okay guys, I'm back. So but it's far to just ah Okay, well that does it for this video on Would You Rather, Either EO, whatever you want to call it. I don't know, this game is crazy. I like it a lot. Well it's not really a game, it's like a web interactive thing. I don't know, I just really like it a lot because like your imagination flows, it goes crazy, it's just like, yeah, what happens with this? What happens with that? I like it. <laughs> anyway, I think that's all I have to say. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked this video, leave a like and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!